Okay guys, a lot has happened. Welcome back to part six, I think this is, of the home theater build for Custom Power Electric. Uh, we have done paint. We have done the electricals, including the low voltage wires and low voltage cover plates. And we got the uh, sound clouds already for electrical and painted. Might be kind of hard to see, but this sound cloud is actually black and the ceiling is in dark gray. And we got the rock walls up and installed. This is travertine stacking tile. Very, very nice. We're going to put the uh, color enhancing and ceiling on that to make it pop even more than what it does currently. We have the fireplace. Also in the tall, it's a 60 inch wide by 13 inch tall electrical fireplace. You can do heat for the basement so when it gets cold, you can kick on the heat. All works off of Wi Fi from your phones. Same thing for these switches. These switches control the sconces and the recess lights in the sound clouds separately. Um, we also got our door. Painted, installed, mounted, and door handle. That's a two and a half inch thick door. So that handle is kind of hard to find, but you found one. Other than that, we are still waiting for speakers to be crossover designed. And that should be within the next couple weeks, and then we'll start doing those crossovers and finishing up those. All components are here and ready, and then eventually we're going to lay this carpet down. Uh, this is the first pick. We're not 100% sure if we're going to stick with this, but this is a 10 inch wide by 3 foot long carpet tile that sticks to the floor after we clean the floor. And we were thinking about doing a horizontal brick style lay-in. But yeah, so yeah, we're moving right along. And soon we will have more videos on the actual crossover design, the painting of all the speakers, and then the final reveal. Thank you for watching.